Good morning, students. Today we will study about the atomic number. In the previous class, we have studied about the electron, proton, and neutron, and we have also studied about the structures of atom and some atomic particles or the fundamental particles in the previous classes. Today we will discuss about the atomic number. What is the atomic number? First of all, to understand the atomic number, let's move once again to the atom. You have seen in this atom, inside this, in the center part, it is known as nucleus. The structures of the atom is like a spherical shape. In that spherical shape, the center position is known as nucleus. Yes, in which there is a presence of proton and neutron. The vitra ke uncha, proton uncha ra, neutron uncha. Ke vitra, nucleus vitra. Which have just ko positive charge uncha, proton ko, ra neutron ko kune charge, muda yada, charge less particles uncha. This is the gari, around the nucleus, Around the nucleus, there is an orbit of the cell in which one neutron electron lies, which revolves around the nucleus. Just so electron ko charge ki unza, negative unza. So now what is that? Now let's talk about the atomic number. Atomic number Q. The number of the positively charged particles of proton which is present inside the nucleus of an atom of an element that is called atomic number. Atomic number means the number of the proton. How much proton is present inside the nucleus? Suppose this is a one, this is a nucleus. What is the number of positive charged particles present inside this nucleus? That is called what? Atomic number. It means the number of the positively charged particles or the protons which is present inside the nucleus of an atom that is called what? Atomic number. It means all the elements have their own atomic number. All the elements have their atomic number. Atomic number means what? The number of the proton which is present inside the nucleus at the center of atom yes that is called what atomic number this atomic number is denoted by z this atomic number is denoted by z whereas we can calculate easily by the formula of atomic number means the number of proton is equal to the number of electrons. It means atomic number means one. How much proton is present inside the nucleus? How much number is present inside the nucleus? That is called what? Atomic number. It means atomic number is also equal to the number of electron. It means number of proton is equal to number of electron. Or we can also say that the number of the negative charge particles or the which is proton or means electron present in fire uh, revolves around the nucleus that is also the atomic number. Here is one question. Atomic number means the number of proton. The number of proton is equal to the number of Electron. Remember, this is the number of the number of proton, the number of the electron. number of the number of proton, the number of the number of the atomic number of the 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 number of number of the number of of the number of the number of of the number of Electron. So, for example, I have an example here. Atomic number of 
नंबर ऑफ ऑक्सीजन कुने एलिमेंट को सपोज ऑक्सीजन को एटॉमिक नंबर आठ एट मींस व्हाट डस इट मींस इट मींस दैट देर इज अ एट प्रोटॉन्स और एट इलेक्ट्रॉन्स आर प्रेजेंट इन द एटम ऑफ ऑक्सीजन इसको अर्थ है कि उन जब ने तेज मार कर दिया उड़ा आठ उड़ा इलेक्ट्रॉन या आठ उड़ा के आठ उड़ा इलेक्ट्रॉन और आठ उड़ा प्रोटॉन दूसरे ब्राह्मण रूप में क्यों होता है प्रेजेंट होता है क्या मान ऑक्सीजन मान सो ऑल दिस ऑल द एटॉमिक नंबर्स डिटरमाइंस द नंबर ऑफ प्रोटॉन एंड द नंबर ऑफ इलेक्ट्रॉन इन इट्स एलिमेंट्स प्रत्येक एलिमेंट को एटॉमिक नंबर होना चाहिए रहा उसको क्यों होना चाहिए नंबर ऑफ प्रोटॉन रहा नंबर ऑफ इलेक्ट्रॉन सो व्हाट इज़ द फॉर्मूला टू कैलकुलेट द एटॉमिक नंबर हमें इस अंदर फॉर्मूला होना चाहिए एटॉमिक नंबर ऑफ इलेक्ट्रॉन ने हमें को नंबर ऑफ इलेक्ट्रॉन या नंबर ऑफ न्यूट्रॉन जति के नंबर में इलेक्ट्रॉन होना चाहिए या जति के नंबर में प्रोटॉन होना चाहिए जति के नंबर पर ही कसून चाहिए एलिमेंट हो ओके नाउ अंदर ओयल चल नाउ लेट्स टॉक अबाउट द एटॉमिक मास व्हाट इज द एटॉमिक मास एज यू नो इनसाइड द न्यूक्लियस देयर इज अ प्रेजेंस ऑफ व्हाट प्रोटॉन एंड न्यूट्रॉन हियर यू हैव सीन इनसाइड द न्यूक्लियस देयर इज अ प्रेजेंस ऑफ द प्रोटॉन व्हिच हैव द पॉजिटिव चार्ज एंड अ न्यूट्रॉन व्हिच आर द चार्जलेस पार्टिकल्स Yes, and the electron which revolves around the nucleus with a fixed orbit or the cell. It means atomic mass. Means here we have seen the sum of the nucleus, the sum of the subatomic particles which is present inside the nucleus. What are the what are the what subatomic particles which is present inside the nucleus? That is proton and the neutron. It means एक सॉम इसको और तक क्या हो प्रोटॉन और न्यूट्रॉन को सॉम बराबर एटॉमिक मास जनरली ट्राई टू नेचर बट इस एटॉमिक मास द सॉम ऑफ नंबर ऑफ प्रोटॉन प्लस नंबर ऑफ न्यूट्रॉन दैट इस एटॉमिक मास यू हैव सीन इनसाइड द एटॉम एट द सेंटर ऑफ द न्यूक्लियस there is a presence of the proton and the neutron in both when the proton positive charge plus neutron charge less particles when both are added we can calculate the atomic mass this atomic mass is always n matrix constant fixed value fixed mass it has no any unit atomic mass has no any unit which it determined by capital A atomic mass we can calculate the atomic mass by using the formula number of proton plus number of neutron now I will show you I will show you what is that number of the proton and the number of electrons here you will see the number of atomic mass is equal to atomic mass is equal to number of proton plus number of neutron yes but now we can this atomic mass is denoted by what capital a then A is equal to number of proton is determined T plus and number of neutron is charged by the gills. From this formula, we can also find out the number of neutron. Yes, how we can find that? Let's see. Or we can do this cross multiplication about number of neutron is equal to atomic mass minus number of proton it means number of neutron number of neutron is equal to atomic mass atomic 
mass minus number of proton number of proton we can also calculate the atomic number of atom means now let's once again review it what is atomic mass the number of the proton and the neutron which is present or we can say that the sum of you can say that the sum of number of proton and number of neutron is called the k one ki number of proton jati cha or number of neutron jati cha dui ta la add gari sake pachi hamro ke auncha atomic mass nisincha hain sum of proton and the neutron that is called what atomic mass isko kune unit hudaina it has no any unit you have seen here it has no any unit and we can also calculate what the number of the neutrons by what by subtracting the from atomic mass to by number of proton we can easily calculate the what number of neutron okay so let's once again mathematically we have seen atomic mass is equal to number of proton plus number of neutron and that is a is equal to p plus plus p into the power zero in this way we can easily calculate the atomic mass now atomic weight what is that atomic weight okay now molecular weight how we can calculate the molecular weight in the atom of the all we can how to calculate the atomic weight in the given elements okay so what is the actual definition of molecular weight it means it is the sum of atomic weight which is present are the atom of same or different elements of the molecules here we see the what is the molecules and the elements and their all their atomic weight which is present their sum we have to calculate their sum suppose oxygen these elements what is the atomic number of oxygen is how much eight now its sum where what is that what is saying our atomic mass weight that sum the sum of these elements it means the number of atomic number of oxygen is eight okay you have seen so at the charge what we have to do we have to multiply it with two then it will be what sixty how much sixty now molecular weight then oxygen of molecular weight is O two then what what is that is oxygen oxygen is A then we have to multiply it with two two and what this is the number of two elements then what is eighteen into two have to multiply it two means sixteen into two is equal to thirty two amu atomic mass unit the body its atomic mass unit the molecular weight the sum of atomic weight of all the atom or the difference of elements which is present into the molecules that is called molecular weight now i have shown you one example of oxygen how to calculate the atomic molecular weight here is oxygen and what what we have to multiply it with two then sixteen and there is also what o two once again we have to multiply it with two then it will become what thirty two so this atomic this molecular weight can be calculated by adding the atomic weight of the elements which is present in the molecules means we have to add the what atomic weight we have to add with atomic weight then only we can calculate the what molecular weight so once again listen one example carefully 
and oxygen yes and oxygen molecules have two oxygen that is O2 yes one two atom there is a two atom present in the oxygen so molecular weight of oxygen is what 16 so molecular weight we can calculate by O2 then it will be the 32 I will show you the next example of carbon dioxide how we can calculate Now let's talk about the molecular weight of CO2 carbon dioxide. CO2. Now what is the atomic number of carbon? Is six. What is six? Then what we do? Six into two plus oxygen is eight and eight into two. Then what we do? Two atom. Then what we multiply with two. Six to the two and plus it to the sixteen into 2 it means 2 plus 32 it's equal to 44 am amu atomic mass unit in this way you can easily calculate the atomic what a molecular weight of the what given substance or given the molecules okay thank you guys